When we see a movie that's just not representative of the real world that we see outside the screen, we just don't believe it. And so Hollywood is starting to realize there's a demand for the real world and representation, and I think they're starting to feed it, and I sure hope they continue to continue to do so. It's unfortunate because I have to think about it. And we shouldn't be in a place right now where I have to be like, well, let's see, let me look back. Actually, you know what? This wasn't the first time, but I I got to see Crazy Rich Asians like an early screening of it. And I was crying afterwards. I was like, why don't why am I why am I crying? Why am I so moved by this? And then I realized this is everything that I that I didn't know that I needed, but I but I do know that I needed and and seeing Asian Americans finally being represented in major roles on screen is a true dream come true. And it's really validating because you can continue to be like, I can actually do this. Because before Tall the Boys, I wanted to be a lead in a rom-com, but I threw that thought away really quickly because I was like, that just doesn't really happen because, you know, I don't think that, for multiple reasons, but a, a lot of it is, you know, unfortunately, Hollywood's not looking for someone that looks like me to be the lead in a rom-com. And that's a discouraging, right? So when you finally get to see yourself represented, you're so inspired and you realize, oh my God, I can do this. It's happening and, and other people are doing it, so that must mean that I can do it too. Someone that re really inspired me was um, Hayden Cito from Edge of Seventeen. And now he's one of my really good friends, but at the time I, I was just a fan and I, I went to the movies and I had not a clue that the lead love interest was going to be Asian and and he was so good and it was so inspiring and Hayden was just like a normal dude and it shows that we're not different we're all the same like we're not like some weird species you know and Hayden that was such a crazy experience watching Hayden because it was like oh I want to do that but girl form so hopefully if if other Asian American actresses, I, I hope that, that maybe if they watch Tall the Boys of Blood before, it, it inspires them as well. And aspiring actors and actresses and, and young girls. That's really important to me. Because it's unfortunate that it, that's a hard question to answer. Because we haven't had a lot of representation. But I do think that we're making, we're making strides. And it, it, baby steps, but you know, you crawl and then you stand up and you start walking and then you start running. So hopefully, hopefully it works out.